In this video, I'll tell you how the reason heavy weapons work so well is also their biggest downfall. In Deep Oaken, players have a wide variety of weapons at their disposal, ranging from daggers to spears. These lighter weapons offer versatility and mobility, allowing players to swiftly launch out attacks and apply pressure to an opponent in fast-paced combat with small damage. However, if you want to destroy your opponent's health bar with a few swings, heavy weapons step up to the plate. Heavy weapons in Deep Oaken are a force to be reckoned with. They pack a tremendous punch and deliver devastating blows to enemies. Whether it's a great sword, a great hammer, or a battle axe, these heavy weapons are designed to deal heavy damage and turn the tide of the battle. But the reason heavy weapons work in Deep Pokémon isn't their damage, it's their speed. Here's what I mean. Heavy weapons can fully utilize mix-ups when paired with fast mantras. A mix-up is a combination of different attacks that require a different response or defense to guard. So, because a heavy weapon is so slow, the enemy is conditioned to the slow parry and dodge timings, making the fast mantras a polar opposite in throwing off their rhythm. If the player tries to become accustomed to these mantras, then the slow swings of the heavy weapon will throw them off. That's why many players pair the Hive Lord Hubris with the Heavy Hands Ring. This combination makes the slowest weapon in the game. Pairing this with fast mantras or abilities leads to a deadly combo in Chime. There is a downside, however. The downside is that a better player will feel less pressured by this combination, and they can parry both the fast and slow attacks and make your speed a liability. But, the speed isn't the only thing propelling heavy weapons through fights. Good players also utilize its range. Learning and utilizing good spacing techniques can take you far in a fighting game like Deep Woken. Try to know the rough distance your weapon can hit compared to your opponent's weapon. If you can figure that out, stay inside of the dead zone and where you can hit them, but they can't hit you. If you can consistently do this, you can land free hits when your opponent goes in for an attack. Finally, heavy weapons have some of the best crits in the game, most instantly block breaking or dealing massive damage. Learning how to fully utilize any property of your weapon can take you very far on the chime leaderboards. It can also lead to you knowing better how to counter your weaknesses. An additional note, heavy weapons are some of the best weapons to fight multiple opponents with, or boss rate, as you have lots of hyper armor and range compared to many other weapons. They also allow you to chunk down those opponent's health bars instead of having to whittle it down with, let's say, a dagger. Thank you for watching. Please comment and subscribe if you'd like more videos like this. See ya.